Uh, hello there. Whoa. Um, sorry that this is a little, you know, just getting into this and stuff, but I'm playing a game called Forest. And, uh, you know what? I'm not even going to explain it. This is just going to explain itself. Essentially, this is a survival horror sandbox game. And, uh, yeah, it's fucking crazy. And it's holy shit loud. I have to fucking lower the volume to this shit. Or make myself louder. Or something. Jesus Christ. <coughs> Whoa. Well, hello there. Are you going to rest my child? What the fuck are you doing with my kid? Hey, come back here. See your ass. Well, that was interesting. <clears throat> okay. So essentially, this game is called The Forest. Uh, I saw a trailer to it, like... Um, like a, 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 a few months ago, I guess? I don't know. Uh, but survival horror, you gotta collect things, you gotta survive, you're in a forest, and you're, um, you gotta, like, fend off against, or you can just fucking fuck up on me again. Oh, okay, never mind. I thought my, my... This game is in alpha, pre-alpha, or not, actually, it's just, it's just alpha. Um, it is in alpha, and there's a lot of bugs, and this is like my 20th attempt to try and get this thing recorded. That is a foot. That's a foot sticking out of there. I didn't notice that. Um, but yeah, I, I'm gonna get out of here because, uh, this place is gonna be crawling with those things in a bit, and I don't know which direction they're coming from. Speaking of, uh, yeah, essentially you just gotta survive. You know, you gotta cut down trees and... All that uh, nonsense, you know, basic survival shit. You can push B, it'll open up survival book. You can uh, look uh, at uh, some of the things you can craft. You can craft, like, shelter. You can craft a log cabin and stuff for you to save. Like, you could sleep and, um, you know, regain some energy. There's a beach. I wasn't anywhere near a beach last time I played this. It was earlier today. I was just getting a feel for it. I'm um, actually, I haven't gotten too into it. I was just, like, you know, researching and whatnot. <laughs> um, anyways, uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna, like, get away from this area, you can eat berries, mmm, yeah, you gotta eat, you gotta, you can't, or else you're, like, starved to death, so you gotta, like, eat berries, or you can hunt animals, uh, I believe you can hunt, you can do hunt for fish, I think, if you have, like, some sort of, you have, like, a spear, like a fish spear, or, a, I don't know what they're called, okay, a fish hunting spear? Whatever, okay, you can craft one, and you can, uh, yeah, so I need to look for somewhere to, to, sh to, to settle down, you know, need to find a nice place, need to settle down, you know, I'm just, you know, I'm ready to settle down in my life, I'm, I'm, I'm done with life, just ready to settle, that's a huge tree, I have not seen a tree like this before, whoa. Anyways, yeah, you'll see some like crazy structures. Uh, there's caves. There's tons of caves. That's where most of those mutant things are. Uh, that's what they're called. They're called mutants. They're very humanoid, but apparently, from what I read about the game, is that they actually have like actual like morals. Like aside from them just being like the standard NPC enemy or whatever, uh, they actually have morals, and they'll think twice before attacking you and. Uh, they got families apparently. Each one has like a family, so each one's like unique in some sort of way. Uh, from what I have seen, they all have like the same like texture. Uh, like they pretty much all look the same. This game is in alpha though, so I don't like I don't blame it. But uh, this is a pretty great game for from what it is. I need to like cut down some trees, but I just don't want to like get attacked from behind. That is what she said. Um, you can like cut down uh, some bushes here, you know, collect some leaves. You can use that to make a shelter later. I want to like cut down the. Ooh! And this is a Komodo dragon, I think. Or I think it's just some sort of wizard, honestly. I thought I heard something. His, t his tail disappears when I like work, look. It's okay. His game's in, in beta, so. Uh, I'm beta. It's not even in beta, it's an alpha. Uh, it's gonna be an update in like 16 days. Uh, it's probably gonna fix some things. This is what the game is for. You know, people to play it for there to be, you know, so they can announce the bugs. Is that a camp? There's a camp over there. I don't know if I want to go anywhere near that. I don't see any of the 
things though in this area. I might want to like keep on going a bit before I like start building shit. You know what? I'm gonna cut down one of these trees just to show you guys what cutting down these trees is like. It's actually pretty darn cool. I want to find a piece of flat land though before I cut down. Whoa! There's water here. You know what? This is where I'm gonna build my um build a, a little shelter. But I just want to like I don't want to be on a hill like on a steep hill because that just that shit bothers me. Um, I don't. I just don't want to make my shit like too close to anything monumental, like a camp like that or something, because they are like they patrol and like you'll just see them walking around and it is so scary, especially at nighttime. Oh god. Okay, like right there, right here. This is a good place, I guess. This is still pretty steep, I guess. Maybe like right here. Yeah, this will be a good spot. There's even water right there. You're gonna have to like, if you get blood on you, there's a chance for like for the blood to get like into your open wounds and infect you. So uh, you don't want that. And uh, I'm just gonna cut this tree until it goes down. I'm gonna do it. I got blood on me. I should probably, you know, take a bath. Uh, just let me finish doing this. Timber! Oh, well, that was awkward. Whoa! What the fuck? That glog went flying all the way over there. Okay, I got one log out of that. Oh, there's the other one. Okay. Um, you have to carry them. You can't. You can't put the logs in the inventory. Obviously, you gotta like c carry them. Uh, you can store them later. You can build like a log storage thing, and you can like store them inside. Uh, but first, this is what I want to do. Um, they're rolling away from me. This is how you build shit. You gotta like put down the plans for it, like wherever it is, you, whatever it is you want to build, and you just kind of like piece it together. Uh, where'd that other one go? I'm gonna have to cut down some more trees. I don't know where the other one went. And the other one went fucking flying across the fucking forest. I think it did over there. Yeah. Awesome. And I need to get some sticks and some rocks. Rocks and sticks are everywhere. You can cut down like smaller trees for sticks. Or even these little things here. Or, you know, it's just not gonna... Are you kidding me? You can't cut this thing down? You can cut down... Oh, okay. I was like, what the fuck? Are you gonna pick it up or what? Okay, there we go. Uh, apparently, the first time you die in this game, like you don't really die, you get knocked out, and you get you wake up in a cave. I guess you'll see that in a bit. I shouldn't have, I shouldn't even really have mentioned that until you know it happened. It's because it's probably inevitable, it's probably gonna happen. So you get like a second chance, basically. Is what I'm trying to say. You get a second chance before you actually die, because when you die, you gotta start it all over. You can't. It's not like Minecraft where you just you know pick up. You know, you just lose all your shit and respawn somewhere else. It's you now when you die, you die. You lose your save. And I really wish it was easier to cut down these fucking things. There we go. Oh, I'm out of sticks. Or I carrying too many sticks. Just gonna throw these suckers on there. I just need one more. All right, now I need some. I need more logs. I need to cut down a bigger, another big tree. This one. But yeah, game's pretty cool. You know, it has a great idea. It's just not polished. Well, it, it, I'm not gonna say it's not polished because you know they did a pretty damn good job on this. Uh, so far for it being like an alpha, there is a ton of bugs, tons. Uh, yeah, there's 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 a lot of bugs. I've experienced so much, so many issues so far. I should probably like, um, like report them. But I'm pretty sure people have already. This is uh, people are playing this. Currently, I don't know how many people are playing this, but uh, yeah, it's it's pretty fucking great. If you ask me, you know, excuse my, you know, language and all. You know, I mean, yeah, who cares? I don't excuse my language. No one gives a shit about me cussing. Um, but yeah. This is what it is for right now, I guess, until you, like, start seeing some crazy shit happen. I mean, uh, I heard that, like, they're gonna, like, implement, uh, like, a mode in future updates where, uh, they're just, you can just get rid of the mutants, like, all together. 
and you could just try to survive like in the forest. Why does it make that noise? That that is that is. I don't think the sound thing works, and I don't I don't even I don't I don't even need that. I could just just drop this right here. Am I being watched? Because these things, if they spot you like from a distance, they will watch you. They will just like stalk you, and then they will get close and fucking murder your ass. I mean that's how it works. I'm just being like I'm just saying. This is these things like have like an idea like they're like tribal like if you get anywhere near like their village they have villages and they live in caves so i don't know like what they do like with their what the hell <laughs>